Hello ladies and gentlemen, back to your general team, Ellie Like. Welcome back to Kingdom Hearts, and well, I went off to do some grinding a bit, so that way I could be ready for the next challenge up ahead, because who oh boy, would, would the next part be a little bit more difficult than I thought it would be? Well, like, with the amount of times I've been dying so much, I thought, oh Christ, if it's, if it's this bad, I better do some, like, grinding just to like keep ahead I guess I'm, I'm not sure what was what happened in the last part honestly like I don't, I don't know like I can't blame anyone but myself for the amount of like just fail in that whole episode so yeah um yeah so I went off to do a little bit of grinding just just a little bit and what I got from it was that I decided to um, you know grind a bit in Wonderland Although, for some reason, at first I couldn't come here because, like, I was at a different place. Like, there's this, there's this weird thing where in this game where if you're in a world, uh, not in the same world, just, like, at a different world that isn't connected to it. Like, I was at the Olympus Coliseum and I was not able to enter Wonderland for some reason. You have to be in a world where it's connected to the other ones. So that way you're able to just go to there free of charge. Like, you know... I head into uh, Traverse Town. I need to go to Traverse Town so that way I'm able to go to either one. Like I'm able to go to um, Alice in Wonderland or Wonderland, or, and then and or the Olympus Coliseum. But if I'm at the Olympus Coliseum, I can't go to Alice in Wonderland or just Wonderland without going to Traverse Town first. So it was a bit of a roundabout way. That's kind of dumb. I'm just glad they stuck. They did something different for the second game. I'll talk more about the gummy ship sections uh, a little bit later because we're going to do another one because we have to go to another another world. So for now, yeah, all this other stuff like uh, except for the pretty stones, everything else here like spirit shards, lucid stones, blaze shards, mithril shards, dark matter, all this stuff I got from Alice in Wonderland sort of either through enemies or through other items and boxes that I got. Uh, real quick, uh, I might as well show the bizarre room uh, how it is now. Okay, as you can see, there's a couple of things that uh, have been added and uh, changed in place. Anyway, uh, there's also that, which I'll explain later. But for now, as you can see, uh, there's a pot over there that wasn't like full. The pan's full. Or that pan came out of the wall. This clock came out of the wall. Uh, there was a book there, but I have to move that teddy bear there, which came from up there. That that's on a uh, like you know like uh, on a shelf that I broke. So it landed in the second chair, like the one on the far, the further, furthest one. Uh, but you can switch the teddy bear in between, so that way... Okay. <laughs> Wait, hold on. <laughs> Dang it, look. I'm trying to do it slow, like... Hold it, hold it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I don't know why that's both creepy and funny to me. Gore. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, anyway, yeah. So, uh, wherever that teddy bear is sitting, it either makes the book appear that's on the, sh on the, you know, over there, or it makes the clock appear so that way you can move it and go through there to get some to some other parts in the bazaar room slash to get some other stuff. Uh, overall, though, I got it. Uh, oh yeah, and those lanterns lit up. The that lantern, the one I'm directly looking at, um, makes that painting appear. And if you light up this lantern, it makes that. Um, Lion head open up, give you a thing, a treasure chest, and uh, also, I think it, I think it says in my journal, right? I think. Nope, no, nope, no, it it it, it doesn't. Oh, well. Gygus, Gygus shadow, large shadow similar to shadow, like its predator is quite persistent and will chase its target around. If it just the little amount of damage to Sora, it will fade out of sheer happiness. <laughs> Okay, so these guys... Oh, yeah. Oh, right. I I didn't want to explain. In this whole bizarre room as well, uh, those things attacked us after, like, a wave or so of uh, regular Heartless or, you know, Shadows. And then the big ones came in. I was like, oh, my God. But, uh, you know, I defeated a couple of them, so it was kind of fun. And it's interesting to see them, but eh, whatever. They aren't terrible, but, you know, it's still weird. Anyway, um, what else was I going to say? Or herp de herp de herp. Anyway, uh, so yeah, uh, throughout this entire room, I've been going through in and out, been exploring some stuff, getting some of this, you know, the things that are in the walls to pop out. 
and gotten some of the items for it. <laughs> it, it doesn't work with Donald because he's not looking directly at me. Goofy, however, you can di he's directly staring at me. Uh, anyway, so yeah, that's the whole thing with the whole room itself, like um, with a good amount of the stuff that's happened so far. Uh, so yeah, uh, also, um, I went into certain places that got me some rare items, uh, or at least one place, which is where the dark matter came from. Uh, also another thing I do want to mention, uh, you saw me use a defense up, uh, for Sora. Yeah, I'm gonna use most of those things just for me, but, um, there was another defense up I found, uh, when I was trying to look around in different worlds, uh, during the Olympus Coliseum thing. Like during my grinding quick thing or getting items and I use those for myself I use that other one for myself so keep that in mind I guess uh, I just wanted to point that out because like some people would say huh your, your defense is higher than usual well that's because I found another defense up uh, in between like the like the edits of you know uh, when I died to Cerberus slash doing the whole Colosseum again because I went out and found some stuff so that that's about it Really, that that's all I really wanted to mention. Really, other than th other than that, I haven't done anything else other than just slight grinding, getting some items, getting some equipment, or you know, getting health items, stuff like that. Nothing too extreme, just you know, normal stuff, I guess. Uh, hold up. Oh, okay. I was like, I was thinking like, what the heck is happening? Oh, turns out... Oh, Christ. Hold it. Thanks, Donald. Nice parry. Oh. Well, okay then. <laughs> I didn't know that was a thing, actually. Yay, a mega potion. Uh, other than that, I also did some plant stuff, and by that I mean I helped a, p a few different plants, you know, with my lightning slash magical stuff or items, all that, you know, good stuff. Uh, I did I did I actually show this next thing? Like, look, I can't I. I can't enter Olympus Coliseum because I'm right here. I need to go either to Traverse Town just to get to Olympus Coliseum, or I need to do this, and then I could go there. Which is stupid. Honestly, it really is. I, I don't know. It's it just, like, in the second game, they actually mitigate this way much better. Which I'll explain in a second. But let's just go on to the next world, which is a level 3 star battle level, and it's going to be a little bit longer <laughs> than a couple of the other levels we've done, because... This one was really, really short, if you really think about it, except for the battles. This one was short-esque, but only because there's, like, all this stuff you have to look for. I'm not sure whether or not I could count Traverse Town as a full, like, a full experience yet, because, you know, we're going back to it. And there's stuff we need to do for it, but that's later. This one, however, is going to be more of a bigger world that has, like, an end sort of thing in mind. And, unfortunately, we're only going to be going to this place once, which is unfortunate. Uh, Story-wise, we're only going to go here once. I might go back to it just to either grind, slash, get some items, slash, you know, just find stuff, you know. On my own time, of course. Well, let's get started. Did I show you guys this new gummy shit that I made? Or, I think? I, I don't know. Uh, it's just a basic one. I gave it two guns instead of a regular one. Uh, unfortunately, I saved over... I saved over the um, actual, like, uh, blueprints of the uh, previous gummy ship, the Kingdom uh, ship, so unfortunately, th that's unfortunate. I, I was kind of hoping to make a new one. Uh, some other thing I tried to do, like when uh, when I didn't realize it, was that I tried to give this uh, new gummy ship a paint job. Uh, turns out you need to have something, you know, the paint job colorization thing first before you could ever really think about doing that. And yeah, I didn't think that through, so I spent like an hour trying to figure out how to change the color on the ship on different parts. I'm thinking like, what am I doing wrong? And then I realized, and then I looked it up and it was like, oh, you need to buy paint. And I'm like, oh, Christ. 
cranked on a bike. So, for now, I can't get pink because it's locked behind something else. And I'll get to that when we get to that. But for now, everything's sort of just, you know, coming up not my way, so I have to wait to get anything. Hey look, I got Sydney. <laughs> okay. If it wasn't S, I would have said we got the state, the city in, uh, what do you call it? Uh, uh, Australia, mate. I don't know. I don't know, Sydney. Jack, be nimble. Jack, be quick. Jack, run with a pixie stick. Anyway, ah, uh, here it is. <sighs> Welcome to slightly copyright material that we can't enter anymore because I don't know. Oh yeah, this, right. Hey, Donald, maybe the king's down there. That's a big assumption there, Goofy, but maybe. <laughs> okay, where was I? Real quick. Uh, I will say, like, in terms of the gummy ship sections, the newer ones, and especially, like, Kingdom Hearts 2's gummy ships, I feel are way better, mainly because it's a lot easier to do and work with, unlike Kingdom Hearts 1's gummy ships, which are a little bit confusing, slash... Oh god, this is hard to navigate, slash, you know, kind of dumb that you can't paint it right away, but whatever. But anyway, let, let's continue. <laughs> right, I already read that. <laughs> In a backwater place like that? No way! Let's move on. Dude, there's no other world we can go to, Donald. I'm pretty sure we have to go there. Hold on, Riku and Kairi might be down there. Let's just check it out. Forget it, we're on an important mission. Yeah, your mission is looking for, literally looking for, Don, li literally looking for your king. He could be there, slash, you need to look everywhere. Seriously, like, judging by, like, the directions, this is the only other place to go, so I don't get what Donald's going at here. Just land. No. Come on. I like how they're popping out of their, like, uh, little bubbles. Ah, phooey. Ah, phooey. We're landing. Sora. Don't touch that. No. Yeah. Hoo -hoo 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 <laughs> I really do think a yeah -hoo 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 was would have been necessary there. Whoa. Jesus Christ. Oy. Like, I can't imagine how much that hurt on the head. Oh, my head. Yeah. Donald? Goofy? Nope. Just a big animal. <gasps> big catty. A big kitty. A catty cat. Sabumafu. <laughs> or what's it called? Uh, Sabor, I believe its name. Okay. Haha! -ha. Take that, Sabumafu. I'm not sure why I'm calling it Sabumafu. That's a. Okay, that thing's not dead. They could have at least, like, animated its eyes closed. I'm sure you. I'm sure it's one of those like, uh, like you could lose, slash win fights. Like, oh, you could lose that fight if you wanted to. Uh, because like Sabor. you're down on the ground. Danger. Sabor, right? Uh, okay. Thank you. Because the way your position doesn't make sense. You. But that's something else. Uh, uh, what is this place? This place. This place. Okay. Where did the others go? Look. I got separated from my friends. Have you seen them? Oh, Christ. Mm -hmm. Friends. 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 Right. My friends. There's two of them. The loud one is Donna. I'm not sure whether you could consider them your friends, but you I'm not saying what? that's not wrong. Never mind. Yeah. I'm looking for my friends Riku and Kairi. Look. For Riku. <laughs> Friends. Right. Something like that. Kairi. Friends. Uh, 
Right. Um... Oh, friends, here. Really? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Huh? <laughs> Even the subtitles don't know what he's trying to say. Not sure I understand, but show me. Take me to Riku and Kairi. Tarzan. Tarzan, go. And I'm Sora. Tarzan, go. Sora, go, go. Did the go, go, Power Rangers. Okay, Jesus Christ. The jungle. Okay, sorry about that. Sorry about that, Jesus Christ. That was rough. Gosh, where are we? I sure hope Sora's okay. <laughs> y yeah. Um, you kind of need him. Oh, <laughs> it was kind of your job to have him because, you know, he's the key. Another gummy piece. Just don't chew on it. Oh, hey there, Clayton. I'm surprised he doesn't start shooting Donald and Goofy. Because they look like animals, you know? Okay, it looks like I have Tarzan with me, and that's it. Ah, Tarzan. The movie character that I like, but unfortunately does not return in any regards. Uh, in Kingdom Hearts, like, one, two, three, any of the sequels, as far as I'm aware. Maybe he comes back in one of the spin-offs, but as, as far as I can tell, most spin-offs he's not there. Which is kind of a shame. You know, I like the movie Tarzan, in all honesty. I like the, like the little story, I like some of the stuff, I like the acting. I will say, to some degree, I can understand some issues with it, at least uh, skin-deep ones. For example, certain people are a bit turned off by Phil Collins' musical things because of how directly it says stuff, like... Son of man, look to the sky. Slip your spirit, set it free. Basically, it's not subtle in what it's trying to tell you at the moment. And while I'm not saying that's completely like a good way of doing like a, a Disney song thing like this, I'm not sure what else they could have done honestly for that because like I can't really see it like as a musical either, like a musical singing musical thing. Not that it wouldn't be good. It's just that I really don't see like a giant. Well, not a giant. Well, actually, a big gorilla start breaking out in song. Uh, the only one I can think of that actually works with that one is the only technical musical, like, song one in the game, which is, um, the whole, um, you know, like, uh, what do you call it? Uh, sh what, how do you pronounce it? Shubops Jambu? It, it's a, uh, it's a musical, like, uh, a, a beat song thing in the middle of the, uh, movie where they... Where the uh, gorillas and an elephant, uh, Tantor, and uh, it's Tantor and. Oh, yeah, right, right. Hold up, let me check something. Uh... Okay, Sabor, Tarzan, right, okay, wait, hold up. Okay, just checking. Okay, I, I know there's gotta be like a name for it. Um... Oh wait, right, Turk and Tantor. Okay, that that's their names. That was the gorilla we saw before, by the way, that Donald and Goofy met up with. That was uh, Turk. Or, you know, some type of abbreviation of that name. Uh, Tantor is an elephant, but he's not in this game, unfortunately. That's what you get for, uh, what do you call it, one of the worlds that apparently can't be used too much? Like, it's kind of a shame you can't use uh, this world. They don't use this world too much. It's like, it should be under their property, right? But no, 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 they can't use it too much because copyright issues? Like, I'm not sure what the reason is. I know, like, Phil Collins songs are somewhat copyright, but, like, uh, could you just not use the Phil Collins songs and just, like, do everything else? Like, I don't know. You guys saw it at the beginning of the, like, uh, the LP. There was, like, all this, um... All this disclaimers, and one of them was a separate for Tarzan for some reason, and all that stuff. So you know, there's your poison. There's pick your poison issues right there. Whoa! 
I, I did not expect that. That was weird. Uh, anyway, so, you know, there's that whole issue at hand, but whatever. Like, I'm not bitter about it, it's just, I find it odd that they can't bring this world back because of either musical rights, possibly some other issue rights, some other stuff. I don't know. And uh, maybe that's also why there's no Mary Poppins world, because, oh boy, the copyright issues on that would be astounding. Or just be a really, really, whoa, 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 whoa. Really, really, really terrible. Ooh. Like, Jesus Christ. Like, if you don't know about, like, the whole thing with Mary Poppins Disney, you really don't know. Like, what happened. Like, regardless of everything else, though, like, the actual movie itself, like, Mary Poppins, I think it's actually pretty good itself. Like, it's actually good of a movie. It's just that the history behind it, slash everything else about it, especially future stuff, oh, God, it's like, Jesus Christ. Uh... They say they're making another movie, I'm like, uh, I guess that's better than what they tried to do? Which was the story about Mary Poppins, except it made it look like Walt Disney was a good guy, but then they screwed over the woman who made Mary Poppins and, you know, uh, depicted her as a shrew. Like, you know, like an, oh, I don't want you to use my character, yeah. like, sort of thing. You should definitely check out the Honest trailers for Mary Poppins, so that way, uh, you get more info slash, you should look it up, because... Ooh, other people can explain it better than I can. And that's why Mary Poppins is not a Disney World in these games. It'd be cool, but unfortunately it's like... Uh, that, that's how... The, the way they handled Mary Poppins over the years, it's like, oh, it seems to get worse. It's like... Well, technically, it's like, oh, I don't want you to use my character. They use the character. Uh, later on. Uh, I don't want you to, what do you call it, uh, make a movie about the story about us. She's dead, they do that, and they just say like, oh, Walt was trying to be nice and trying to do a thing, and then they made her shrew and not really represent it correctly. Like, all this stuff, and I'm like, Jesus, man. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff to that, and I, I'm not really going to get too much into it. Ooh, boy. Ooh, like, like, it's really, 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 like, not disturbing, just really odd and not really something I want to get too deep into. I mean, I, I know I'm already doing that, but still, you know. Uh, uh, okay, just, ju just checking something. So, yeah, Tarzan. Good movie. Um, uh, I don't get why it's copyrighted like this, but whatever. Whatever. It's not my, it's not my uh, place to say anything, but whatever. Now we gotta follow Tar... Turzin, Turgain, Turgano, Oregano. Okay, treat top. Wait, what? what? Okay, um, huh, interesting. Climbing trees, um, tunnel thingy. I think I need to go down here, right? I've never gone off the path before, so. Sorry, I'm mean, like, like I just talked about Mary Poppins. I'm thinking like, okay, what else can I talk about? It's gonna be like weird. Tarzan, you should have been able to dodge that. But anyway, like I was talking about Phil Collins' music. But... I thought about like Phil Collins music and then I went off in a tangent about Mary Poppins. Mary Poppins Fresh. Motherfucker. Mother. Sorry. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm like just like, I'm, I'm just outright just like, I'm doing crazy. I don't know, like, what else to say other than just what. Like, I'm, I'm making myself depressed thinking about it, but. Uh. Uh. I. Let's just get to the next cutscene, I guess. Like, this is really awkward for me.
Jane. Okay, there we go. There's Jane without Tazi. the yellow dress, but. Oh, and who's this? I understand uh, why. The there. point in the movie. I'm. Oh, you speak English. Yes. So then, obviously you're not related to Tarzan. No. Are you here to study the gorillas? There we go. Highly doubtful. Seriously, I'm surprised you didn't Whoa, shoot them. Goofy, Donald. <laughs> A circus of clowns. Not much use for hunting gorillas. Mr. Clayton, we're studying them, not hunting them. This is research. Eh, your father well, would agree, but the more the merrier. Do make yourselves at home. Well, anyway, I'm saying, huh? Sora, look what we found. Look at this. Look at this. Oh ho ho! Oh ho ho! Oh ho ho! What's that? A gummy block. It's the same stuff used to build our ship. So that means King could have could be here. Either that or it's just another gummy block because we found another one of these when we fought against um, the trickster, the boss in Alice in Wonderland and or I think something in the Olympus Coliseum. I, I'm not sure. I can't remember whether or not there was a gummy piece around that part. But I know we did see another one of these pieces. So we've got to work together to look for him for now. Fine, I'll let you tag along. For now. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, yeah, that's another thing I do want to mention. Um, that is another thing I want to mention. Um, I actually did... Um, I actually found... Um, wait, hold up. Oh, yeah, that's why I replaced Donald, by the way, because... Um, Tarzan acts as a secondary mage, and he actually has a healing ability. Oh yeah, that's also another thing. Uh, Donald Goofy got some abilities while doing the grinding. I got some new abilities. Um, uh, there's also certain, like, uh, gummy parts that's... Hold up. Oh yeah, right. Also this. Um, by the way, uh, Goofy got this um, uh, fire ring, which dropped from one of the, um, uh, you know, the red heartless things. I think they're called raspberries or something, or blue, red raspberries or something like that. Uh, uh, he, they got those things. And I gave, uh, Goofy and, and Donald certain little things, depending on what it is. Uh, Jesus Christ, Donald, your level, like, jeez. Why are you, like, seven slash three levels below, four, five levels below Goofy? Jesus Christ. Uh, I don't get how that works. Hopefully it's, it's a balancing issue that can be fixed, I guess. Anyway, uh, I'm trying to, like, think. Where can I find this stuff? Okay, maybe here. Right, okay, right. There was also some other gummy blocks things that also, that were, like, just around around. Like, uh, hold up, I'm pretty, oh yeah, Scan G, Thunder G, Thun, Thundara G, Meteor G, right. Yeah, all of these little items I found in a Wonderland world as well, so there you go. Also, I found some Dalmatians and, you know, a lot of other stuff. It's just, like, two other chests I couldn't find and another location I couldn't get to. So, you know, there's that. Apparently, Tarzan was raised in the jungle by gorillas. Communicating with him still isn't easy, but he's learning. So, he was speaking in gorilla back there. Technically, but the subtitles say he's just speaking in nonsense. Alright, uh, that's right. You're looking for your friends. He said Riku and Kyrie are here, and one word I couldn't understand. Ooh, but, uh. Why don't we try this? We will show Tarzan some slides and see if any can match what happened. Oh, what happened to the slides? Yeah, we need to find the slides. Anything else? Nope. So... We have Goofy, who's just an attacker, and uh, Tarzan, who's a mid-sized healer. Seriously, it's the first healer we have had in a while. It's like... Oh, right. God damn it. I forgot about that. Hold up. 
not that I don't like Donald, it's just I hate doing this. Like going back and forth. Hold up, let me check something. Nope, they they didn't really add that in later on. Ugh, dang it. Okay, real quick, in Kingdom Hearts 2, you could just outright like change your party on the fly. But unfortunately, in the original, you really couldn't do that. You had to go to save points in order to actually switch out party members. Oh, um, a few more Dalmatians. Okay. Uh, like, uh, you had to go, like, to the actual save points, like, right here. Go to party. Switch out your party members. And you're done. I want to give Tarzan some uh, attention, at least a little bit. You know, give him some room to do stuff. So, you know, there's that. Okay, there we go. Like, seriously. Jesus, let me get to the dang... Hwa. Like, dang slides. Like, it pushed me back, or I grabbed it and it just is like... Duh. Okay, I I don't know what else to, I don't know what I just said there, but you know, you, like I don't know, I, I don't know. Oh yeah, this the campsite, right? Like shoo bop jambu. Uh, application, applicating items. Okay. Hold up. Okay, there we go. Okay, how many slides do I have? Uh, one, two, three, four. I need five. I think there's only six slides, I believe. Oh, oh, <laughs> okay, I like, think like, oh, Jesus. Um, Clayton's the name. I'm a hunter, not a researcher. Okay. Yeah, I know, I know you're... Uh, light the stove, be careful, whatever. Um... Hmm. Recipe, ether. Ingredients, potion. Okay. Alright, oh, I think I remember this one. Hold up. Hold up. What are you talking about? I read the thing. What are you talking about? I read the thing. Switch one. Ingredients. Potion. Wait, what's this thing? Okay. Apparently that's a flower. What the hell? Like, that's so weird. Like, I just hit it and it retracts and then it goes back and forth. This isn't Wonderland. This is like semi the real world. As real as it gets with a uh, giant uh, monkey man. Speaking monkey talking not. And they're being raised by a human. I'm not saying that is a bad thing, just saying. Like, none of the Disney worlds are too, like, the same, but either way. Uh, ice the ingredient. Wait, what? What? Okay, wait, is this is this the part I'm talking about? Uh the potion was put in. Deep freeze. Deep freeze. Oh, uh ah. Oh. Okay, like I was wondering, um, how do I do the thing? Okay, there we go. I did the thing, y'all. Okay, there we go. Some of these notes are in up, very obtuse places, but whatever. Okay. Thing, thing. Okay, well I did everything I could with the potion thing, whatever. Well that was fun, I 
guess. I don't know. So there you go. I turned a potion into an ether and also into a high potion. Yay. Like, I honestly don't know what else to say other than... Okay, cool. Okay. Um... Is there a slide here? Oh, right, this happens. I forgot to mention that. Um, sometimes in this world... Sometimes in this world, in certain areas, instead of Heartless, you fight Sabor. Sometimes. You, you can deal with him later and finally make him stop, but... That's later. And right now, you just deal with him. Uh, at certain parts. It's sort of random when he decides to attack or if he appears. There's certain areas where he does just, you know, primarily spawn. You know, not, not like all the time. It's just like, oh, he spawns in these particular areas sometimes. I believe. Or maybe he spawns everywhere. I don't know. I've never really found him and encounter, encountered him in certain areas where Heartless usually spawns. So I'm guessing there's something to that. Like, oh, no, maybe I'm right, maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Okay. Heartless? Nope. Okay, good. Like, I'm trying to think. Uh, where's the other slide? Because I have all... You know, like, I have one, two, three, four, and six, but I don't have five. Okay, whatever. Don't help me, I guess. Watch out. Uh, like, I'm really, like, trying to struggle, trying to find this, like, stuff I need. And this is why, this is why I, I decided to, maybe this episode might be split up into two. Like, this whole world might be split up into two parts because, oh boy, I'm already reaching a certain point. And it's only, like, half, like, I'm not even ha halfway done. And that's, like really bad on my part. It's like, how am I doing so poorly here? But anyway, let's actually get over here and get to this. Ah, uh, finally, slide number five. I was, like, I saw the corner of my eye, I was thinking like, oh, there it is. I keep forgetting I have a dodge roll, at least enough to where it's supposed to work with me, but I keep forgetting to use it. Which isn't good, because it's supposed to be, like, the best thing you need. And also, that's also another thing why I did so poorly against uh, Cerberus. I forgot I had this ability. Yeah. I'm an idiot. I know. But I'm trying. I'm trying my best. Okay, let's just save real quick. And let's get onto the slideshow. Because that should be fun, right? Slides? Slideshows? Okay, we have a castle... What's wrong, Sora? Uh, what? Uh, nothing. This place, it just looks so familiar. But how? I've never been off my island. Oh, yeah, that is something, that is something, uh, by the way. Uh, Sora technically isn't going crazy that he's seeing Kyrie everywhere. Like, he just saw Kyrie, and I think he might have seen her somewhere else. But he's not going crazy, and it'll be explained later. Because, like, that castle is also something else, like, he's seen because of Kyrie, and you'll see what I mean. Let's see, um, we have, um, person holding a flower, or giving something, you know what I mean, like, a man giving a woman flowers for affection, which is, the, which I'm surprised isn't the primary image that they show last, is that, that image was significant in the movie, like, the Tarzan the movie, it's weird. Uh, old lady holding a, um, a baby, or is that a man? I don't know. A gorilla, a boat, a classic boat, two men fencing. Oh, Jesus. It looks like the, this one got burned a bit. And that's it. Well, Tazan? Where are my friends, Riku and Kairi? He never said he knew where they were. Hey, I thought... That leaves just one place. <laughs> Young man, we've been in this jungle for some time now. But we have yet to encounter these friends of yours. 
I'd wager they're with the gorillas, but Tarzan refuses to take us to them. Really, Mr. Clayton? Tarzan wouldn't hide. Then take us there. Take us to the gorillas. Gorillas. <laughs> it still looks awkward, just like staring blankly at each other. Tarzan, are you sure? Tarzan, go see Kerchak. Kerchak? He must be the leader. Perfect. I'll go along as an escort. After all, the jungle is a dangerous place. <laughs> At the <laughs> that just stupid ass grin that comes out of nowhere. It's funny. <laughs> uh, Kingdom Heart, uh, Kingdom Heart One visuals. No matter how much polish you put on them, still don't look that like bad. It's just they they don't look that great either. Uh, anyway, I wish I could go too. But gorillas are wary of strangers. So the smaller group, the better. Yeah, and the guy holding a shotgun is a good idea to bring along for the trip. If you can't tell, Clayton doesn't feel like a... like a really good guy. Keep hitting him. After him. Nah, I'm just kidding. Turns out you really can't go after any of these uh, gorillas. <laughs> after any of these. Uh, whenever Sabor leaves, you can't really chase after him. It's kind of a shame. I really wish you could chase him and finish him off, but no, you have to wait until a certain part to do that. Although I'm surprised uh, certain Heartless haven't come out just yet, actually. And I'm, I'm, and I'm kind of shocked that you can't do this experiment more. Yeah, that would be cool. I'm, I'm thinking you can do it on a return trip, but not now. Okay, let's uh, let's actually get up there. Uh, the Swing through the treetops on the vines. Like jump on to grab a vine, and swing next, and then jump. He's flying through the air like like a fair with of bees. Okay, there's a there's a there, okay there. I'm trying to sing a specific song. I just forgot how to sing. So give me a break. It's been a while since I've sung that song or seen that movie, which is a good parody movie slash its own good movie. I have no idea how to consider it. Uh, for those of you curious as to what I mean, it's the George of the Jungle movie with Brendan Fraser. Uh, that movie is both funny and pretty decent, like a movie in its own right. Although weirdly enough, it's it, 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 it's it's a parody slash the joke thing on uh, Tarzan itself, like the actual story. I think, I believe, is like the idea of like Tarzan goes really really way back, just like every other Disney property. It was already based on something else. Like, you know, Tarzan itself was based off a book someone made of the same name and Disney just made its own thing. Anyway, point is, although weirdly enough, uh, Disney owns, technically owns the rights to both Tarzan and George the Jungle. Well, actually, they made their own ad adaptations of them, so it's kind of weird. It's like, huh, you expect that from, like, one of them to be owned by something else. Like, maybe Warner Brothers made the... Uh, George of the Jungle movie, but no, Disney made both. So it's cool. Uh, but anyway, uh, Tarzan goes really way back, and George of the Jungle came out like years later. Not sure how many years later, but it came back, came out years later. I think it either started as, I think it started as a cartoon series, like a really old cartoon series. And then it got picked up as a uh, animated film. No, no, not an animated, uh, live action film with Brendan Fraser, and it's pretty funny. Still funny today, honestly. So, you know, uh, just 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 go check it out. The movie because it's pretty funny, and I do suggest it because it's it's still pretty decent for what it's worth. The sequel, though, I'm not sure about because I, I like you did see it, but. I, like, I really don't want to comment on the second movie. 
Ooh, boy. Overall, though, yeah, I think it's fine. Like, I think, uh, not, not the film, I'm talking about, like, the, like, I'm talking about the first movie. Again. I think the first movie's fine. It does well for what it's worth. So there you go. Yeah, man. I have no idea why I'm singing that song, but eh, just want to. Dang it. Uh. All right. I'm thinking like, is there 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 is supposed to be a fast button, like an actual like oh press uh, something to go faster, and lag up the game, which is the circle button. Hold it. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. And thank you, Mr. Hippo. Hold up. Aha, more Dalmatians. Just as planned. Sort of. Eh, kind of. Anyway. <laughs> trying to think. Oh, yeah, right. So, uh, the parody slash thing. Oh, right. You have to go here. Right. Kerchak, please listen to me. I know the nesting grounds are secret, but I trust them. You see, I want to help them because, because, well, they need us. <coughs> oh, did you get that? No. How do you two not get that? You're both animals. You should understand a little bit of stuff, right? Especially. Definitely Donald, considering he speaks almost ridiculously, like, almost incoherent. Uh. Wow. He seems sort of distracted by something. Jesus. Well, was he looking toward the treehouse? Ah, uh, Jesus. Like, that was a quick turnabout there. It's like, oh, it's talking cutscenes? Oh, now it's not cutscenes. Or not talking cutscenes. It's like, now we're back to text. That's really weird, but whatever. <laughs> Jesus Christ, calm down, game. Or stay with me. Stay on target. Stay on target. Tree top. Right here we go. Uh, tunnel. Oh right. I can't get back to the tree house through there. Find the tree. I think this way is the right way. I believe. Maybe. Uh, here we go. Tree house. Here it is. And there's Kerchak. No, not Kerchak. Uh, Turk. Or she has a longer name, but it's supposed to be just Turk or something like that, right? Hmm. What's the big idea? Wait, Kerchak, please. Uh. I can't speak to you because I'm disappointed. And not because I don't have a voice actor. <laughs> also, Donald looking at the gorilla really weirdly. Or just deeply, it's like weird. You don't understand. I was only trying to. Uh, a snake slithered by. You see, I saved that poor gorilla's life. Sure you were. <laughs> Trust me. Well... If that really couldn't tell you whether or not, like, uh, what do you call it, Clinton was a bad guy, I'm not sure what else, what could, honestly. Why do you think Clinton's not in this game, too? Like, why do you think, like, Clinton's not in the League of Villains? Because of copyright issues. <laughs> like, as far as I can tell, they really, like, Come don't on. really give too much love in the first game for Tarzan too much. It's unfortunate, but copyright issues, I guess, I, like, I don't know. Like, again, I don't understand it, but whatever. So for now, not that many characters talk except for Jane. 
Tarzan, maybe one of the gorillas if it bothers, maybe the mother, I think. Uh, and I'm, I'm not sure Turk Tur Tur actually talks at all. And I don't really know whether or not Turk actually talks much. All we've really heard is just her scream, and I think that's actually taken from the movie, like the actual audio file, I'm pretty sure. But whatever, whatever works, whatever whatever is the case, maybe. Whatever whatever happens next is just purely just nah, now nah, we have to deal with it. So hmm, I'm pretty sure what we're gonna have to go do next is go back somewhere and do some other stuff. God damn it. Well, I'm pretty sure I can do this quickly, so give me a minute. 